So here we have a problem, a special relativity problem, and this is actually taken from the 2016 VCE physics exam. And it states, when Anna is halfway between Earth and the space lab, she sends a radio pulse towards Earth and towards the space lab as shown in figure two. As observed by Anna, which one of the following statements correctly gives the order in which the signal is received? by Barry and by the space lab. So this question is quite peculiar because um, when we talk about, specifically, when we talk about radio pulses, so I'll just find where it says radio pulse, this is actually the radio pulse, the velocity that a radio pulse is, because it's part of the electromagnetic spectrum, it will be traveling at the speed of light. And if we remember Einstein's second postulate, that means that the speed of light is like a universal speed limit. So these radio pulses, even though she has a velocity moving at these place, they're moving towards their respective points at the speed of light like so. Now, given that, we would th think that, okay, while she's at the halfway point, the signal will be received at, by Barry and the space lab at the same time. Now that may be true if we're not considering that Anna is moving at a set velocity. Therefore, given that she keeps on moving, sorry, apologies for that, she keeps on moving. So we could say here, so I'll just draw it by a couple of diagrams. So here's Anna in her spacecraft. Here's Barry and here's the space lab. Okay, so we'll just draw it like so. And this is initially. And what we'll do is we'll have a look at one photon. Okay, we know this photon is traveling at the speed of light and one photon traveling at the speed of light towards Barry. Now at this point, they've got the same distance. So if Anna was going to be stationary, we would expect that, okay, both signals are going to be received at the same time, both by Barry and this um, space lab, and Anna would observe these. However, the important thing that we need to consider is that Anna is moving at a velocity. Therefore, so if we call this time initial, and then we call it, let's say, time some, some time further down the track, and this is our halfway mark. This is Barry. This is our space lab. Okay. We can draw Anna. She's because she's moving with a little bit of a velocity. She's moved part of the way. We can have a look at these photons. That yet. Yeah, they're getting close. Okay, closer to their respective uh, points. But what we, what we would notice here is that Anna is likely to see this photon be received by the space station first off rather than Barry. You gotta remember that this photon also, this, this photon here is also tracking so the light coming from the photon has to be traveling back at the speed of light for Anna to observe it. So this is really a key kind of question to have a look at Einstein's second postulate. And therefore, from Anna's perspective, we would say the space lab, space, she sees the space lab, receives the single first. So the answer here should be B. Thank you.